Hello everyone, this is Blood Queen Zero, and I am here to do a reading for Gemini. Gemini, this is your monthly reading for the first half of December. This is for December the 1st to the 16th, 2022. So, um, I'm going to try to keep this reading as short as I can. I'm going to try to keep it under a half hour. Because um, I started the monthly readings late. I started the monthly readings yesterday. And I got to do all 12 signs. So, I'm trying to keep the readings under a half hour. So, I can get them out the way. At least for the first half of December. So, Gemini, please keep in mind that the reading... It may or may not resonate with you. Some parts of the reader might resonate. Other parts of the reader might not. Um, keep in mind that timing is fluid. So this reading can manifest the first half of December. It can manifest later on down the line in time. Or well, this present reading could be past energy for you. If this present reading is past energy for you, then there might be answers or closure for you in this present reading that pertains to your past situation or circumstance. So, um, Gemini, I did get messages during the pre-shuffle. I picked up a lot of opposites. Um, when I tapped into your energy, Gemini, at first I was happy. At first I was excited. And then I just got sad. So, um, I think your overall energy, Gemini, you're overall a happy person. Or a situation is very happy. But it's just the highs and lows. Happy than sad. Happy than sad. Um, so something could be going on concerning a marriage, something being exposed, or something going on concerning your career. But overall, I think the energy is good. The energy is happiness. But it's just the highs and lows. Um, and then I heard, um, I channeled the song um, Beyonce, or was it Destiny's Child? Um, Emotions. I think it's called Emotions. I'm going to post that song in the description box and in the comment section. So, um, how that song go? Um, it's just emotions taking me over. Caught up in sorrow. Lost in the song. But if you don't come back, come home to me, darling. Something. Yeah, that's the song. If I said the words correctly. But, um, yeah, that's that's what the song I heard. So, the song, the link to the song is mostly, more likely going to be in the comment section before the description box. So, just keep that in mind. Alright, so, what's Gemini's overall energy? Oh, so Gemini, I'm going to put your oracle. Your oracle is your overall energy. This is what's crowning you the first half of December. And then, I'm going to pull you an issue from the issues day. So, Gemini, keep in mind that the issue could be an issue you got with somebody else. Or the issue is some is the issue is somebody else got an issue with you. So it's your issue or somebody else's issue with you. Or something like that. So it's just to make you aware of an issue that could be going on with you or somebody else. Alright. What's Gemini's overall energy? What's Gemini's Oracle? What's crowning Gemini? Yeah, see the light. It flew out in reverse. So, Gemini, I think you're going to be sad. Something is good, though. Something is good, but I think you might be a little bit sad or disheartened, um, Gemini. The first half of December. So, something might just be sad. Yeah. Um. Um. But it don't have to be nothing major, and it don't have to be nothing bad. So, uh, Gemini, say like you're a parent. This could be like your child, like, traveling out of the country for, for the first time, or your child moving out out of the home. So, that could be, it's, yeah, like something, it's not nothing major. Um, it's like, you, you just sad, Gemini. Or you could be thinking about a uh, past on loved one or something like that. And it just make you sad. You probably miss somebody. Or like I said, your child or something could be leaving the home. And you just a little sad, you worried or something like that. So, yeah. See, that's the energy I picked up on during the pre-shuffle. I heard that Beyonce song. So, 
or something like that going on. So what's the issue going on with Gemini? What do Gemini, what's the issue Gemini need to be aware of for the first half of December? What's the issue? See, two came out, that Gemini energy. Do I want to take it? I'm going to take it because you're a Gemini. So the unknown and cha challenging lover. So Gemini, something, you don't know something. You or your lover don't know something because somebody's a challenging lover. So the unknown leaves you in the dark about things. Uh, difficult to deal with. So Gemini, your lover might leave you in the dark about something because your lover feels as though... You're a challenging lover. So something could be going on concerning love and romance. Gemini with you. Gemini, your lover might leave you and not tell you why. Or y'all going to go through like a brief breakup. And your lover is not telling you why. And it's because they think you're difficult. Because somebody's leaving you in the dark. Yeah, about something. Or Gemini, you had to leave somebody else in the dark because you feel as though they're difficult or something like that. So something's going on concerning love and romance. Or Gemini, you could be sad because your friend is sad. So something could be going on with your friend or a, a family member. So you could be sad because somebody else could be sad or something. But those are the issues. Somebody got an issue, Gemini, you or somebody else. That somebody leaves somebody in the dark about things and then somebody feels as though somebody is a difficult lover. All right. So I'm just pulling two tarot cards so I can keep the, the reading short. So what's going on with Gemini? What can Gemini expect? Yeah, we got the two of swords coming out in reverse. So Gemini, this could be you or you dealing with another air sign such as yourself, a Libra, or an Aquarius, or Gemini. The two of swords in reverse could be somebody um, that's overly stimulated. Somebody could be overly stimulated. Um, this could be mentally or emotionally, but the sword. So I'm going to say mentally. Somebody could be overly stimulated or they're doing too much research or somebody uh, too much of anything is not good. So this could be somebody doing too much research, too much talking, too much thinking. And now somebody could be overly stimulated. Um, somebody could have a runny nose. Gemini, if you a mother, maybe a father, Gemini, you could have kids and you might have to call out of work or something or cancel some plans because your child might get a bad cough. Somebody knows could be running like a lot. Somebody could have a runny nose. And it could be your kids. And Gemini, you got to call out of work. Or cancel some plans or something because the child could be sick. Oh, this could also be somebody figuring something out. And we got the fool. Gemini, you or somebody else might do something that y'all never did before. And, and, and you might regret it. A little bit. Somebody did something they never kind of like did before and they might regret it. So the food, this could be um, Aries or Aquarius. So Gemini, you could be dealing with an Aquarius as well. Or you could have those signs in your chart. The food is Aries and Aquarius. So we got Aquarius out here twice because the two of swords could be an Aquarius too. Somebody could have lied about something. Yeah, somebody could have lied about something. Somebody know the truth and somebody lied. That's what I'm picking up. So, Gemini, you could be keeping secrets or somebody else keeping secrets. Because it say somebody left somebody in the dark. The unknown. Somebody knows and somebody don't know. Then we got the moon. Everything is not always as it appears. This could be secret enemies. Yep. Yeah. 
Somebody could have like a guilty conscience or somebody is very anxious because they lied about something. What's the spill with the two of swords? Somebody could be dealing with a hater. Then we got regret, yeah. Someone regrets what they did to you, what they treat, how they treated you, how they contributed to the mess. So, Gemini, somebody is aware of something. So, Gemini, somebody lied to you. And it could have been an Aries or an Aquarius. Somebody lied to you. This person know what happened. Somebody could be cheating on you in love. Somebody played you, deceived you. A lover could have left you in the dark about something. Someone regrets what they did to you, Gemini, because this person know what happened. Or this person knows. Somebody knows. Or Gemini, somebody regrets something that happened with you. And they could be getting high. Somebody could be snorting. Um, somebody getting high because they regret what they did to you. Or somebody going crazy. Somebody could be looking for you, Gemini. Gemini, you could have left because somebody pissed you off or something. And somebody want to know where you at or something like that. What's the spill with the fool? I'm also picking up Gemini. Somebody lied to you and made you uh, disregard your own intuition or your own common sense. So, Gemini, you said the sky is blue. And this person convinced you the sky was green. And something happened. It's like, Gemini, you was right in the, the, the first time around or something like that. Or somebody just lied to you and they regret it. Or Gemini, somebody talked you into doing something that you regret. So Gemini, say like you're dealing with a lover. And when you first met your lover, you said, do you have a girlfriend or do you have a boyfriend? And Gemini, your lover, your lover was like, no. And Gemini, you said, I, I think you do. Something telling me, I, you, I think you do. And Gemini, your lover convinced you that you was their one and only. They just straight up lied to you. Or something like that. And Gemini, you could have left your lover and they could be getting high. They snorting. Somebody could be having like bad nosebleeds. Or it's like Gemini, somebody is either getting high or um, this person know what happened. Or something like that. Somebody not confused. Somebody know exactly what happened. What's this spill with the fool? Gemini, you probably don't know what happened, but this person know what happened. Yeah, sabotage. Yeah. Yeah. Gemini, somebody sabotaged you in some type of way. Gemini, I think you could be upset because you went you went against your better judgment. Because you trusted somebody that you should not have. So I think you're a little bit sad about a betrayal. Or you're disappointed in yourself because you let this person talk you into something against your better judgment. I'm also picking up Gemini. You could be sad because somebody didn't tell you the truth. Gemini, you could have been trying to help somebody. And they didn't want to tell you the truth. And somebody could have got hurt. And they should have told you the truth from the beginning. Or something like that. Give me a charm card for the two of swords in reverse and regret. Yep. These cards keep coming out in twos. Somebody did. I'm going to just keep it. Somebody did something risky. And Gemini, somebody could have made like some type of negative impression in your life. Gemini, you could have lost out on like a business deal because of your business partner. Somebody did something risky because somebody wanted to make impressions. It's like, Gemini, somebody wanted to impress you so they lied to you, but it could have cost you like a business deal. Somebody wanted to make impressions or impress you. 
So somebody did something risky. Something didn't go how somebody wanted it to go. Yeah, it could definitely be another ear sign. What's this filled with the fool and sabotage? Cake, a milestone. Gemini, be careful because something could be going on concerning baby daddy, baby mama drama. So, because this could be my card for like somebody got a daughter or somebody could be pregnant with a girl. Gemini, if you a female, Gemini, you could have let a man talk you into like marriage or getting pregnant. Yeah. Gemini, you let somebody talk you into something. And it's like, Gemini, say like your baby is like three. Or they gonna be three the first half of December. It's like, Gemini, this man promised you, I'm gonna do this. I'm the best father. You not gonna regret it. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna take care of you. Gemini, your daughter three and this man still don't got himself together. It's like somebody broke all their promises or something. It's like, Gemini, somebody's disappointing you because they didn't keep their promise or something like that. You went against your better judgment and you could have married this man or you got pregnant and y'all have a daughter. Or Gemini, um, your child's father might not show up to y'all daughter's birthday. And Gemini, your child's father is lying to you about something. The reason why he didn't show up for the birthday party or something. And Gemini, your child's father know the truth, but he lied to you about the reason why or something like that. Or Gemini, you probably regret getting an abortion or something. Gemini, you could have got an abortion in the past or you're going to get one the first half of December and you're going to regret it. Or something like that. Or your child's father going to do something foolish. Your child's father going to do something foolish. Um... <laughs> Gemini, this is like you at work. Gemini, you could be at work and your child's father is like babysitting. And it's like, Gemini, your child's father got like called the ambulance because your daughter, the baby nose started bleeding or her, uh, uh, um, somebody nose could be running. And Gemini, your child's father could have panicked and called. He either brought the baby up to your job or he like called the ambulance because of a nosebleed or something. <laughs> and Gemini, you just sad. Because <laughs> your child's father, he probably don't know. Gemini, somebody could have been trying to impress you and they didn't know what they was doing. Gemini, be careful because I also see... Um, Something could be going on with a baby and it's like, Gemini, your child's father should have called you while you was at work instead of bringing your baby to the hospital. Because somebody was trying to impress you. They wanted you to think that they was responsible and something might happen. So, Gemini, be careful. Gemini, say like, um, today the 9th. I'm doing this reading now, today the 9th. Say like on the 8th Gemini, which was yesterday, your child fell. It wasn't child abuse. But Gemini, your baby fell off that bed and bumped their head. And they probably got a lump or something on their head. It's like, Gemini, you didn't bring your baby to the hospital because you felt as though there was no need to bring your baby to the hospital. And you didn't want no issues with the doctors. It's a possibility that they might call child services on you. So you didn't bring the baby to the hospital. 
It's like Gemini, your child's father going to be babysitting the kids while you at work. And he might bring the baby to the hospital because the baby nose won't stop running or the baby nose might start bleeding. Because your child's father didn't want to call you at work. He wanted to show you he was responsible. It's like Gemini, your child's father going to get up to the hospital and they might call child services on him. Because they're going to look and see the bump on the baby head. From like the fall, the, the, because the baby fell like the day before or something like that. Yeah. Gemini, I also see if you like a teacher or you do daycare or child care and you working with babies or toddlers, be careful because a parent might bring a child to you that's sick. And some, it's like this child might faint or something while they're in your care. And Gemini, the parent is going to regret not telling you the truth about the condition of their child or something like that. It's like, Gemini, when the parents dropped the baby off to you, they should have told you the baby fell the night before or something like that. Somebody didn't tell you something. Because it's like, Gemini, somebody, this could even be your child. Gemini, you could have an adult daughter. And it's like, Gemini, something could have happened with your grandbaby and your daughter didn't tell you because she wanted you to believe she a good mother. So the baby could have fell and she didn't want to tell you because she wants you to think that she a good mother. So somebody was trying to impress you and something might go wrong, Gemini. With your child or like your grandchildren or something. Somebody was trying to impress you and they did something risky and it sabotaged something. <laughs> so Gemini, just be careful with like child services and stuff. If you work for like at a daycare or something, um, Gemini, just make sure you do like a questionnaire. Cause this can even be something with COVID. Somebody child could have COVID and they didn't tell you. And, like, the whole classroom might get it or something like that. And, Gemini, you going to be sad or something? You probably got to shut down your whole class or something like that. Because, like, this parent, they wanted to impress you or something. Somebody did something risky. Or, Gemini, somebody sabotaged you on purpose. Yeah. Because they, they wanted to make an impression. But something going to backfire on this person. If this person did this out of malicious, they would be a malicious. Something going to backfire on somebody and then they're going to be in regret. Because somebody could have been trying to sabotage you, Gemini. Gemini, I'm picking up if somebody did something to your child in the past. Their child is getting karma the first half of December. Somebody getting karma. Gemini, somebody did something risky towards you. This is out of, they was being malicious malicious or they wasn't. If this is malicious and it involves kids or something, oh god, somebody gonna get karma. Gemini, somebody could have did something to your daughter. And something might happen to their daughter. The first half of um, December. Yeah, something like that going on. Or Gemini, you could be getting karma because you did something to somebody or something. Somebody getting karma. This sabotage could have been something of the past. And it could be, somebody could be getting karma or something. So, yeah. Tell me more about regret. Gemini, I also see for some of y'all, if you a female, you might find out your lover got an outside baby. And Gemini, in the past, your lover told you that he didn't want to have kids or he made you get rid of your baby. And Gemini, you're going to find out that this man got a baby with somebody else and the baby could be three. 
And Gemini, you leaving this man. You leaving him. Or something. You just disappointed in somebody that just lied to you. Off the grid. Yeah. So Gemini, whoever offended you or sabotaged you, this person gonna go off the grid. I'm also picking up Gemini. Somebody is going to tell you that your husband or your child's father was at the house. Or a woman is going to tell you that she pregnant by your lover and she's going to regret it. Yeah. Somebody that's in regret is off the grid. Or Gemini, somebody regret making you go off the grid. Gemini, you went off the grid. You might ignore somebody or block somebody. Or stop hanging around somebody because of what they did. Give me the spill with sabotage. Gorgeous. Damn. Somebody try to do something with your looks, Gemini? Or Gemini, you mad? Because like I said, your baby could be three, Gemini. And you sacrificed like your body. Gemini, you probably don't have kids. And you had your first child with this man. So, Gemini, you feel as though you sabotaged your looks or your body or something. For this man, he wasn't even worth it or something like that. This could be your body because you was pregnant. Yeah, or something like that. It's like, Gemini, you could have sacrificed like a modeling career to get pregnant. And it's like you sacrificed. This man told you he was going to be there for you. He would pro provide for you. Gemini, you gave up your career. You could have been a model. And you let this man, you got, you was pregnant. And it could have sabotaged your figure. And this man done left you. And you can't get your job back because you was pregnant. Yeah, so you just sad. It's like you love your baby, Gemini, but you love your daughter. But this man just played you. He lied to you or something like that. Yeah, you just sad. You disappointed in somebody. Yeah. Or Gemini, somebody was trying to get you jumped or rolled on or somebody wanted to sabotage your looks. Or Gemini, your lover lied to you because he could be jealous because you're gorgeous. And you tired of it, Gemini. Your lover could be very possessive, possessive very jealous because you're gorgeous. And you just tired of him being jealous? You tired of it? Yeah. It's like you could be married, Gemini, but you can't. This man is driving you crazy because he jealous. Yeah, or something like that. Gemini, I also see your lover might end up in jail. Because I don't know. Gemini, you could have been out somewhere. And the man could have said something to you or looked at you the wrong way. And your lover, like, attacked this man and he might end up in jail because he was trying to impress you. Because you gorgeous or something. And Gemini, you don't think this is cute. You sad. Your feelings hurt or something. Yeah. So, something like that going on. So this is Blood Queen Tarot. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and or share. And Gemini, enjoy the, the first half of December and thanks.